Hi everyone again, uh, this is my um, second video for um, my uh, wind turbine um, that I'm trying to make here. Uh, I'm getting ready to re rewind a uh, coil. I had to uh, rewind it. I tried to use a different adhesive uh, to keep this together and it didn't uh, stick to the, uh, to the coating so I had to break it all apart and now I'm going to try to rewind it. Um, so I thought I'd just put this on uh, on YouTube. Um, I made several um, test coils, and um, I already uh, uh, did my testing with my um, rotor, and um, I'll, I'll put those um, those findings up on the screen for you in a little bit. And um, maybe somebody out there can help me tell me if they're good readings, bad readings, because uh, I really, I really don't know um, a lot about it. But um, if you could help me out there, appreciate it. They look good to me, but like I said, I'm not real sure. Uh, what I've done is I've already used um, some shoe wax on these uh, discs to stop the um, adhesive from uh, adhering to them. Uh, I have my um, lead coiled up in here, and um, I'm going to get ready to turn it. Uh, this is 15 gauge wire. Uh, it's not the easiest to work with. It wants to do its own thing inside here. It bends, uh, it stays bent. Um, you can't control it real well, but that's just the wire I decided to use. Uh, I don't know if it's good or bad or. Or, or what, but um, that's what I'm using. Alright, let's get started. I have a counter here, but I also uh, count myself in my mind uh, to try to make sure I, I get these right. What I do is on the first, uh, on this first level, Okay, I got one level down, it's all the way across, and I'm going to um, mix this up, and I'm going to put the, a coat in three places around the coil just to keep it, uh, keep it together. Try to work quick with this. It dries out pretty quick, so I'll probably have to mix up another batch before I get done. And then you can go probably two or three uh, Basically, do this to. Uh, I mean, we're eventually going to tape this, but this is to hold it together uh, when we take it off the uh, the jig here. Thank you. 
and 65 turns there. I want to make sure where the 65th turn is is going to stay stay put. Let's just mix up a little bit more. Alright, that's uh, 65 turns. We're going to let that uh, go. And like I said, um, on the screen here, you'll uh, be able to uh, see what I got for results. Um, the ohm setting was on uh, 200, and I got uh, 0.3. I noticed everyone else has uh, uh, on the 2K setting, and they get uh, 1 point something. So I don't know if that's good, bad, if that means... Uh, something bad or not but if you could help me out there I'd appreciate it and uh, on the 160 uh, rpms uh, between 160 165 I was getting 1.6 to 1.9 on the voltage so um, that'll be up here on the screen and if you could uh, probably write into me and tell me what you think I'd appreciate it uh, hope you enjoyed it and uh, have a good day